This is a single snapshot of what federal agents describe as a treasure trove of Native American artifacts looted from more than a dozen Sierra Nevada archaeological sites. Can you just take, take that and just look at that for me? I showed the snapshot to Miriam Hinman, one of the federal prosecutors who handled this case. I see items that could have told a story about how ancient people lived. Hinman, the prosecutor, also has a master's in archaeology and chose to be on this case because of her passion for examining artifacts. The illegal digging in this case desecrated ancient sites that were important to the Washoe tribe and were unusually valuable to archaeologists. Court documents show Timothy Bryan Harrison spent a decade digging up more than a dozen archaeological sites in Alpine and El Dorado counties, ranging from hundreds to thousands of years old. The area is the ancestral homeland of the Washoe tribe. Daryl Cruz is the tribe's director of historic preservation. Um, every time they take away an artifact, it takes away a piece of the history, the puzzle that makes up that history. Federal agents were tipped to the illegal digging by hikers. Court documents show investigators then began following Harrison's movements. Officers installed covert surveillance cameras in the area near his digging sites. And GPS tracking data showed Harrison frequently parked near archaeological sites for hours on end. Eventually, they found approximately 302 pounds of artifacts comprised of an unaccounted for but estimated tens of thousands of artifacts in Harrison's home. None of the artifacts were sold. He kept these things for himself in his house. A massive federal investigation into looted Native American artifacts. A decade of digging, destroying centuries of archaeological evidence.